fine, thank you. Yeah, thank we you. met, uh, we met in, yes, 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 in, yeah, Belarus. in Belarus. Yes, yes. so... In then. Uh, what happened in your life since that time, since your Belarus visit? What, sorry? What happened in your life since that time, since Belarus visit? Oh, um, when life was ready, from when, when I was in, in, in Minsk, mm -hmm. when life was in the process of life. So when we started, when, when mm -hmm. I came back from, for, from Belarus, um, I went to the studios and we started recording One Life basically and I really I, I was totally concentrated on, on One Life and it, then it came the festival of the, of the Maltese, uh, the Maltese uh, festival so uh, I was totally focused to the, and then after obviously the festival three months of hard work you know yeah. And now finally I'm here. <laughs> so did your Junior Eurovision experience uh, help you in some way to... Yes, I was part of the delegation, so I was behind the scenes. And yes, this helped me a lot. But obviously it's different, eh? over here. Loads of press, you know, it's... But yes, it's helped me. So you have been traveling a lot. Uh, can you tell us more about your promotional tours? Where you've been? Oh, yes. What you've seen? Yes, I started from Croatia, Greece and Portugal. And then I went to... Uh, Armenia and Georgia, then Holland, it was a party in, in Amsterdam, um, UK, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Italy, mm -hmm. and back to Malta. <laughs> basically. Uh, so it was been... quite tough, but I really enjoyed it second by yeah. second. I really enjoyed it. You're a big Eurovision fan, so you probably heard all the songs participating. Yes, I'm a, Euro I'm a Eurovision fan, yeah. so every year I hear all the songs. And this year, so it's an exception. Person, you know, I think that this year there's quite a lot of different styles of music and different styles of singers, and it's gonna be tough.